All right, gamers. So yes, finally, finally, finally. So of course, I'm back with a really quick. Of course, of course, progress. Uh, looking about a video. So of course, but yeah, of course, I'm excited. I'm happy. We got the new heroes units for um 2023. We got new easy We got a whole bunch of stuff to do in the game. I don't even know when I'm gonna summon because I have so much stuff to freaking do right now. My boom button just in my mic a lot. But yeah, of course, we got some new stuff. We got some new news. We got new everything, of course, right now. But yeah, of course, I'm excited. I'm ready to go for this. Since maybe some people will cover it. Maybe some people will not. You don't really need to buy this, honestly, though. But it's for all the Dragon Ball Heroes units for um you can get with the silver stone that you can purchase in the um shop right now um again you do have to purchase and buy it though but uh for all these heroes units you don't really need to do it because they're all in the banner and you can just summon and get them but they are harder to pull so that's why they put them in here because again all these guys are going to easy a next year so we're about like we have a, like a clear list you guys are going to easy a god trunks pan xeno pan uh maki kabora some kind of time and of course rebel they're all good easy next year so we kind of have a good road of like what's going to happen because you know we had this last year so we knew these guys were going to easy a we had this year before we knew these guys were going to easy a um but yeah we, again, we have a whole bunch of just like i said new stuff in here to talk about and go over though so yeah um silver sounds back though so pretty much we had this last year where you can get the heroes units um but like i said there, there's a summoning banner for them you don't really need to you know get them or anything like that um because all of it like all the heroes units are literally just like um on the summoning banner, so you like you don't really do it. Oh, that's what I meant to do. I forgot to load my summoning banner for the video, for my own last video. So give me one second. Let me redo this really quick. Let me do this really fast, really, 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 really quick. Though, of course. Okay, I'm back. Had to pull up everything, of course. Uh, this is the regular, um, just easy a, not regular, but this is just easy a banner for heroes. This one's actually pretty simple and down to the point. Um, you pretty much summon, you get featured units. Um, because they're all SSR guaranteed, I believe. So, um, just for like, um. For all the multis, is yeah. This one you can do discount is three times if you want to do it. You don't have to because again, you don't have to. It's do three times discount multis, thirty stones if you want to. If you want to get some more heroes units, you want to get a chance because they are the only SSR on this banner right now, which is great. So if you need to get some old units, maybe get some new units. It doesn't matter. I realize we had a whole bunch of heroes units. Holy crap! Um, has to be like at least twenty or more. Um, but yeah, if you want to just get a, like Vegeta, if you're missing out on him, Broly, Xeno Dabora, just in case you miss him, I have all of them already though, so I got nothing left to prove here. I really have, I have no need for this banner, so. But you know, if you missed some units from last year, you know, um, the units from last year are on here. Uh, so then goes for the regular heroes banner. This one looks, this is easy, the best one, honestly, for the, um, the line art, that's great. But yeah, of course, it's the uh, new units. Um, then of course, SSR is again, same banner though. I, I don't think the Godtrunk, is Godtrunk's on this one? Okay, 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 I had to make sure. I'm like, wait a minute. The other heroes units are all on the banner. They're the only SSRs on the banner. Um, but yeah. And this one, I think, has every hero's unit, though. Yeah, this one has every hero's unit. This one has the newer units. Because they don't have all... Okay, they don't have all of them on here. Yeah, they don't. So it's pretty much... some All the units from, like, what, 2019? No, yeah, 2019, 2020, 2021, 2022... 2023 and this one has all of them though so i think this one's your better bet if you're just missing out on units but if you may want feature units you're going to want to do this one so pretty much if you need feature units if you need these guys something on this banner if you're missing a lot of old units they're all on this banner pretty much like the world tournament banner where you pretty much basically are like okay um i need to um uh not something but um uh, i'm trying to think right now if you need to i can't even think um if you just need old units pretty much if we want some fidget units, this is a better banner. If you're using some old units, this one is just when you get the new units. I'll put something on both anyway. I don't care. I'm wasting my stones on this thing anyway. So, um, if you're missing old units, but you want some good new fidget units, you're missing out on these guys. This is the better banner. If you're missing a lot of units, you will get mainly featured though. But I mean, hey, it, they're all in SSRs. You gotta, yeah, that that's that. And of course, this one you're gonna be getting a lot of SSRs, uh, just from like all the old units and everything. So, um, if you need some, like I said, if you just don't need all the units, you just want to get the new units. But you still want some old ones here from last year. Here you go. But if you want every unit, here you go. Here's the better banner for you. You get mainly getting, like I said, the featured units, but there's no SSRs in the banner, and you got these guys in the background. So, what else? I'm on both anyway. I don't care. But yeah, time to go over each unit. You should get Silverstone. There's a lot of units on here, and it's just there's a lot of choices you can do. But I recommend you don't really need to do it anyway, just because, again, they're all on the, this banner. If you're missing out on all of them, but you just want the new units are on this banner. But again, you really don't need to. But it just gives you want to buy it anyway, because a lot of people might buy it. But yeah, I'm gonna of course, you know, go over it, say guys like, yeah, okay, um, here's what you should get though. Starting off though, all these units are really, really good. Like I trunks. If you want to get him, go ahead. He's um still a pretty good unit. Uh who else is on here? Uh Xenopan's a really good support. 
Uh, Meki Gabora is a pretty good support. He can he again they don't hit all the hardest though. They like support mem like support I support character numbers, but they do hit um they they can they can do some good stuff. Like, they have some good support. Like Meki Gabora is really good for support. I don't see a lot of people talk about some kind of time anymore, but I think when she gets easy A control, when she gets easy A, I feel like she'll be better. Now, same thing goes for Rebel. Don't really see a lot of people talk about her that much though anymore, even though she is. Honestly, I'm sorry to say she's the hottest Dragon Ball character in the series for me. I don't care. She is the one for me in Dragon Ball hair. I like just girls with long blue hair. I think I got a type, guys. I think I got a type. Red eyes, blue hair. Let's go. Uh, I think I got that typing down. Broly, like I said, is really good to his easy A. Uh, Bardock and um. I think Bardock's a really good, another good unit. Gohan is really good too. He can't get hurt a lot in the red zone, but he can do still be pretty okay. I think he's probably like not the best one out of all these uh, for Super Saiyan 4 Gohan. But I mean, hey, whatever's whatever. Take what you can get. and uh, is good support. Um, Doctor's Toe is amazing. I think she probably is one of the best units you should get. Definitely you should get. Gordon Core is not bad though, but he's tied to the crossover team if you want to get that. Same goes for Vegeta. You really don't need him that much. Um, Unless you're like building like a Super Saiyan 3 team where you just need like a, these guys. You don't really need these three, honestly. You don't really need to. They're okay, but you don't really need them. Um, Super Saiyan 4. Actually, yeah, he's a, he's another good recommend. Like, these two are probably like the one of the best recommended, though, because Toe's a disgusting support. She's amazing. He's insane, too. Like, he's a really good unit, though. Uh, just good crossover support and main support. He's really good. On to the um, Planet Earth characters. Um, this guy you don't really need for Great Saiyan Man 3. You don't really need. There, he, he's just a counter unit. He doesn't do that much. He takes a lot of damage. So I'll say not. These guys are good support too if you really need it though, but you don't really need them because they are, again, like I said, mainly support. But they're not bad though. They're not bad. Um, but yeah, let's just use like the main support for like Goku, you know, Vegeta. Um, they're, they're actually, I think Goku's a little bit better than Vegeta, but they're both good. They're both the same unit though, pretty much. Kumbu can be very disgusting too. Like when he, um, when he adds his EZA and everything, he can be really disgusting. So about her, like just one hit, he stuns everybody, and he does a lot of damage too. Elo's attack defense, he, he's a good asset. Who's not bad here though? He mainly seals super attack though, but he can help out too with some good support. Um, uh, Jimmy Girl's Minotra form is not bad either. He's another good support like Toa, but I just he's he's like uh, kind of a diet Toa in my opinion. He's good though. I think he's had some good support on him, but um, Super Mario probably not though. I don't think you're gonna be worth buying him. Um, same goes for these two though. Um, they're not bad. But Vegeta mainly does, um, or Black Mass saying, he's not bad, but, um, it's just that he only does, like, additional crit, that's pretty much what's his kit. And you're good, too, but you gotta get hit a lot, so I'll probably say not these guys. Um, Seals isn't that bad, though, he does transform, he does do some good damage, so I'll see him do some really good damage. On to these units, though, some of these units are amazing. Um, so the Super Saiyan just get tank a little bit, though, he can do some good damage, but... I'll probably, say, if, I'll probably say not get him if you don't want to, but he's another good asset unit. Toe is amazing. Probably say get, probably get her. Uh, Zeno Goku, he's a definite yes. He's an amazing unit. He's he's good. He can do some good damage though. Uh, but like I said, Super Saiyan three, so about a row, he saved my he saved my butt. Uh, Vegeta, he doesn't really do anything special, honestly though, in my opinion. So yeah, nothing crazy. Super God of Time, definitely yes. She's amazing. Super Saiyan three Go Tank, Adult Go Tanks isn't that bad. I'd probably say not. Same good for Pycon, not really. I don't see people using that much. I mean, at least Go Tanks can help you out with some damage, maybe, but I say probably not. Nah. Yeah, you're a good unit. You can tank pretty well. You're actually not that bad. Um, Boo Bobbity isn't that bad either. He just mainly stuns though. And Gohan, I know, is um not a bad unit either. He can actually do some pretty good damage. Level ten links. But for main units, I'll probably say honestly, yes, yes, yes. Um. A definitely yes, probably. I'll say a definitely yes. Definitely yes. Definitely yes. I want to say yes for these two, but I'll probably say no, honestly, though. Um, Probably these three, honestly. I mean, those, the pan's a good support. Nikki Gabor is not bad. Like I said, it's hard to pick, though. Like I said, it's hard. That's why it's hard to recommend because they're, they're so good. Like, they're not, like, all of them aren't bad. They're actually all pretty good, in my opinion, though. So that's why it's always kind of hard to choose. But my choice is probably maybe Xeno Pan if you want to. Maybe make a Kabora. is a good support though. But I'll probably say yes. 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 Yes, yes, and yes. Probably say those guys. And yes too for Baby Jeanette. But he's actually a good tank. Um Go's not that bad either. One. And like I said, a lot of humans have aged now. Not aged, but aren't really that not good, but it's just it's not like eh. Like not like not runnable. They're runnable, but it's like, hmm. 
just no. Like, just not, like, a big L, in my opinion, that one. It's like, I'm just like, yeah, you don't really need to get them or anything. But like I said, so for someone, like, you really don't need to get that one, honestly, though. But for my recommending units, I say yes. Yes, because these two are amazing. Uh, Burley's not bad either. He can just take a tank, but he has a nuke, though. But these two aren't that bad. Uh, Cumber, I'll probably say good, definitely. Yes. 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 And yes. If you want to get one. If, I think it's just one, though, so. Um, it says three, though, but I think that's just, like, the stone to have, but... Those are probably recommend units I get though, honestly though, because those are probably the best ones in my opinion. So if I skimmed over it though, I just went over these guys so many years now, so I'll have everything in my eye up above and everything on the side though. But yeah, see you guys there though. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, great life. I'll go check in though. If you stay safe, watch and God bless all of you for going up and over mass on tour paper for really do get back to the camp. Go aside to the same copium shop, my friends and Discord social for where you guys are awesome. But you guys think about all this what you guys think about all this though, of course, though you like you hate it again. Very simple, very easy, like I said though. Um but yeah, though, of course, hope you guys have fun. Hope you guys, uh, you know, get the heroes units you want to. Sorry if I skimmed over a lot of it, though. It's just that all these units are old and aged out now. But, yeah, like I said, the recommended units are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. If you really want to hardcore get them. The pan, like I said, these three aren't that bad, actually. It's just that, you know, or, you know, baby Janetta too. Because all these units have, like, you know, are kind of aged out, dead. I mean, they're not runnable. They're not not runnable, but it's that their passives don't really shape up with the meta we have nowadays. And... In my opinion, I'm just like, yeah, you can just easily just skip them, though. But, I mean, Zudabor isn't that bad either, though. I would recommend him, but you don't really need to waste us, buy a stone of waste on him, though. I'll probably say just get those units I recommended, though. But, yeah. See you guys there, though, again, though. Peace out.